fire season is not even upon us. And we have never had that many fatalities in one year before. Six fire related deaths in Winston Salem this year. That is a record breaking number and we still have two months left in 2022. Good afternoon. Welcome to the Fox 8 5 o'clock news. I'm Katie Nordine and I'm Neil McNeil. Many of these calls have been kitchen fires and that includes one last month at the Bethabra Gardens apartments. Two people died. At least four <laughs> others were hurt. Fox 8's Aaliyah Sims is live at the Savannah Place apartments on Magnolia Branch Drive where fire crews responded around five o'clock this morning. Morning, Aaliyah, any word on a cause of this one yet? Well, Neil, discarded smoking material displaced eight people from here, and a 64-year-old woman had to go to the hospital for treatment. This is helmet camera video firefighters captured as they pulled out their water hoses to douse these red hot flames. We were asleep at, at 5 a.m. and we heard like some severe banging on our door. Um, and it was one of the residents upstairs yelling, get out, get out, fire now. The flames consumed the side of the apartment building on Magnolia Branch Drive in Winston-Salem. You can see burning debris falling from the third floor of the Savannah Place apartment home. I would have slept through the alarms and everything if it wasn't for them. So, I mean, thank God for them. This fire is the 266 Winston-Salem fire crews have fought this year. Winston-Salem Fire Risk and Reduction Specialist Teresa Knopp says families can take steps to cut down on those numbers. It starts with paying attention to what's on the stove. Knopps told Fox 8 unattended cooking is the number one cause of fires in the city. In all my years in the fire service, I have never stood in a yard with a family who said, I just knew my house was going to burn down. And I really think it's time for your viewers and for everyone to change that attitude that it's not going to happen to me. She warns people to not cover smoke detectors, take out batteries, and encourages them to consider one of these, an automatic stove suppressor. They are a magnet to your uh, hood, and there's a fusible link. When it reaches a certain temperature, a, um, a, an extinguishing powder will drop upon the fire smothering. A safety feature to protect you in today's home, where she says you have less than two minutes to escape when it's on fire. It's because the materials used today are more combustible. If you don't change that attitude, which means changing your behaviors, then you're going to be standing in that yard. And it might not just be the loss of your home. It could be the loss of a loved one. Now the good news out here, no one lost their life in this fire. Not says like a severe weather plan, you also need one for a fire and that means to have a family escape route. Also a safe meeting place outside in case your family has to evacuate so everyone can be accounted for. Live in Winston-Salem, Aaliyah Sims, Fox 8 News.